The first unit in grade 4 is numbers and sum enumeration. This unit includes subunits like whole numbers, decimal numbers, fractions, operations in mathematics and money. The first three subunits were covered in another video and if you want to check those please check the description box. This video covers the worksheet ideas for the subtopics, operations in mathematics and money. The unit operations in mathematics covers the four basic operations in math. In order to achieve the learning goals, please prepare worksheets similar to these. Add the following. Addition of four digit numbers. If you want, you can put five digit numbers too. Subtract the following. Before moving on to multiplication, make sure your child knows the multiplication tables. For the multiplication table revision, you can provide them with worksheets similar to these. For the revision, another set of worksheet is represent the following numbers in terms of multiplication facts. You have to provide them with the product and they have to represent that product in terms of multiplication facts. That is 45. 45 is 9 times 5. Multiplication of 2 digit by 1 digit. First provide them with numbers without carryover. And when they are comfortable with doing that, provide them with numbers with carryover. Multiplication of 2 digit by 2 digit number. Multiplication of 3 digit by 1 digit number. Multiplication of numbers by 10, 100 and thousands. For the smarter kids, you can put this type of questions too. You can start division by simple worksheets similar to these. A child can use multiplication tables to solve this type of problems. 2 digit by 1 digit division by long division method. While teaching this, make sure your child knows the four terms in division like Dividend, Quotient, Divisor and Reminder. Division of 3 digit by 1 digit. Division of a number by 10, 100 and 1000. You can also provide them with word problems. A grade 4 student will be able to identify Canadian coins and bills that is used in circulation. They will also know the names for different coins. For the revision, you can use this type of worksheet. Add the following money amounts. You can provide them with numbers that add up to 100. Subtract the following money amounts. Convert the following dollar amounts to cents. Convert the money amounts in cents to dollars. Write three different combinations of bills and coins in a way so that you can pay $34.65 to the store. This type of question is really good for improving analytical thinking. You can also make the learning session interesting by making bills and coins in paper and using it. The game Monopoly also indirectly helps achieving the learning goal for this unit. Word Problems Worksheets is another way to motivate the child to apply the learned skill in daily life situations.